Today we're celebrating our Disability Awareness Month and we're doing that by celebrating also our 10th year anniversary and our 5th annual Vulture Wash. We pull out the red carpet and we say you are the VIP and we want the community to see and feel that people with disabilities have many abilities and today we're honoring them and we ask everyone to um, to share the love and the celebration not just today but every day. And you get to meet different people and you get um, advice from different places and information to help you with your disease and even how to get around and do different things. It's the beautiful faces like Corinne, her face, her smiles, uh, when they're getting haircuts, when they're getting their hair done, uh, the music, the food, uh, the new friends that we meet. I was up there doing an exercise class and I get, all, I get like crazy up there on the stage. So all that kind of good stuff. So that's, that's my favorite part. It's just, there's just so much to it. And overall, I think it's just seeing the community um, come together different cultures, different types of disabilities, different people, just enjoying the Hi, day. Hi, how's everybody doing? The funding and the networks that she has helped establish for the families that are a part of this network. And it isn't just Latinos, it's everybody. So she's one of a very rare group of people that is providing this service nationally. The sad statistics are that uh, today, according to the U.S. Census, there's over 560,000 people who want to work that are living with a disability. And uh, there's no jobs, and we need more people to invest in them and to look beyond the disability. I have MS. I was diagnosed at age of 21. And you feel alone once you're diagnosed, but when you come to Familia Unida, you meet different people that have MS or even different disabilities. And you don't feel alone. You feel like, okay, you know, we're all the same. We can have fun. We can talk about anything. This is my first adventure to the uh, wheelchair wash. And I uh, would sign up to do it each and every year, each and every time. It's such a special uh, occasion. I feel as if I have rejoined the human race. Every year it gets a little bit bigger because our goal is that uh, by next year, we'll have our annual wheelchair wash represented in different parts of Southern California and different parts of the world because we are receiving calls and emails from people all over the country as far as uh, Puerto Rico and Mexico, Texas, that want to be a part of the Familia Unida wheelchair wash. And of course, as we're growing, we need more sponsors. We need more help because we cannot do it on our passion alone. And so I'm grateful and thankful that the Christopher and Dana Reed Foundation has come on board to help us to produce this video and to also sponsor uh, Paseo Sin Limites, which is a uh, new program that will give our members an opportunity to go on field trips. In commemoration of your 10 year anniversary celebration and your fifth annual wheelchair wash, I wish to commend you for all your services to making our community more aware about disabilities and the support that they provide to everyone. They don't discriminate against anyone. This service is to help all families that are in need. Congratulations on a successful event and may the future bring all of us and your families continued success. Thank you, Irma. Thank you, Board of Familia Unida and all the partners that are here.